Okay, hi everyone, welcome back to another video. I had hoped to bring you a video of the Great Conjunction this week, but unfortunately the weather did not play ball. So the weather in Sirencester has been pretty bad this past week. Lots of rain, lots of cloud, um, and unfortunately I didn't get a glimpse of the Great Conjunction. I did set the scope up on the front drive, um, but like I said, yeah, the, the rain and clouds just rolled in after about 15 minutes of being out there. So no, um, no image of the Great Conjunction, um, but hopefully I should have a few hours of clear skies tonight. So as you can see, it's not very nice at the moment. Grey, it's actually drizzling with rain as I'm, as I'm talking now. But tonight there should be three, four, maybe five hours of clear sky. So I'm going to set up nice and early and then I'm going to photograph, hopefully quite a topical target for this time of year. So I'm going to go after the cone and Christmas, the cone nebula and the Christmas tree cluster. So this is a narrowband target, so I'm going to be using the narrowband filters. I'm going to be using the wide field scope, the William Optics Z73, and hopefully I get some good data on this. I'm going to be setting up down the bottom of the garden because the target just about clears the top of my house. And as I've mentioned, the rain has been terrible this, uh, this past month or so, so the garden's actually really sodden at the moment. So I'm a little bit worried that the scope might sink into the mud. So what I'm planning to do is find some old planks of wood that I've got in the garage, um, put them out down the bottom of the garden and rest my scope on that. Hopefully that does the job. Um, but rain's starting to get a bit heavy now, so I'm going to go inside. Hopefully it clears and I can set up while it's still light and then get some data uh, later on in the evening. When um, I'm setting up, I'll take you through some of the, the, the equipment that I'm using tonight. As you can see, a couple of planks of wood underneath the tripod legs. Um, like I said, just some old old bits of wood that I found in the in the garage. So hopefully that will keep it and stop it from sinking. Because I don't know if you can see, but the grass is incredibly muddy at the moment. We've just had so much rain. But this is the setup I'm using tonight. So I have the ASI 1600 mono with the HA filters on there. I have the William Optics Z73 which is 430 millimeters, and the EAF, the automatic focuser, and on top I have the mini guide scope, the 120 mini guide cam, and the ASI Air Pro. All of this is sat on top of the NEQ6 mount. So anyway, that's my setup for tonight. Hoping it stays clear. It's quite cloudy at the moment, but it's supposed to brighten up. I'm just gonna chuck the, uh, the cover on the scope now, just in case it does rain, and then wait for it to get dark. Thank you. 